Hi everybody, John here, owner of The Simplest Biz, about the pallet business. I know attention spans, spans are short, so I want to get right down to it. I want to cover today posts inside the private Facebook group that comes along with the training, what the students are doing, but I picked out specific posts because I need you to see some dynamics that are going on that might have gone over your head so far, okay? So let's get down to it. First of all, give me a thumbs up if you could, if you like the video, subscribe to the channel, Hit the bell so you get notifications down the road. We just hit 20,000 followers on YouTube, so I'm very happy about that. All right, so the thing I want to point out about this one, picking up 150 mixed pallets from a new supplier today. The thing you need to pay attention to is mixed pallets. So important. We teach how to move mixed loads in this business model, not just standard pallets. There's so much of these other varieties and styles out there, and you need to know how to do this. That's why I specifically brought this up. I want you to understand the massiveness of being able to move mixed loads of pallets, okay? Very important in this business model. Makes your life so much easier, and that's why I call it the simplest biz. About 80% of, of the product is good. Okay, so there's a whole other aspect to this business and another revenue stream that can come into play uh, with the 20% that's not good. And that's taught in the training as well. Uh, it's going over some proprietary information. In this group, a lot of stuff is shared that I can't just share to the general public because people have paid for this. Okay, so that's why you got some of the red marks out. So uh, the last one, one hour delivering to a mixed load buyer. Very important. Again, price is six twenty five. Each will grow seven hundred and fifty dollars in profit before labor and fuel for about three to four hours of effort. So, what does that come to per hour? That's good money, folks. Right? Uh, I want to move on to the next one, but again, remember from this slide: mix loads of pallets are so important. And if you know how to do it the right way, there is so much of this stuff out there. When simply moving mixed loads of pallets pulling in having your truck loaded without having to uh, mess with it much at all okay let's go to the next slide i'm gonna make this a little bigger and scroll down a little bit uh, this is from william he's giving a recap here just uh giving y'all a recap of my week i secured a new supplier of 4840s and all types of oddball size pallets all for free all for free. Very important for you guys to hear that as well. 95% of our stuff's for free. And even when we are paying for some styles, we are quintupling and uh, quadrupling and sextupling our money. All right? Uh, so that's an important point I wanted to bring out. I got uh, all five locations of this business. Meaning, you get a lot of times you can get one account and they have multiple locations across the city, this type of environment with one account can keep you busy all week long. We're not having to kill the world. This is a massive revenue stream built into one customer. Five locations this business has. I also delivered three loads of pallets to a buyer and sold four wooden oddball pallets to blank buyer and so 40 plastic pallets as well so we're dealing with plastic pallets oddball sizes um and then we can get into the other stuff as well if i scroll back you notice all these loads are different especially if you see that where the the blue pallets are located so these are all separate loads going to separate businesses uh locations of one business in one city i hope that opens your eyes because you know, you get one account like this, you set. All right, very good stuff. I'm going to pause and go to the next one here. Wooden spools. Fantastic. Other revenue source. And this is taught in the training as well. Okay, so let's go over this one real, so, uh, real quick. Uh, one of my students. Some work lately. To today I made over $700 in spools above. 15 in one day, new record for me, very pleased, still delivering pallets to an account up the street for me. That's important. We deal in tight radiuses in this business model. We are not traveling all over the state. You know, a lot of times we, the way this is taught is we are traveling 
in a five block radius from point A to point B. That makes your life, that translates into free time, folks. Translates into less stress. It translates into getting your work day done quick so you can spend some time with your family. So important. And I want to teach you guys the right way. Only reason I know this stuff, 23 years of doing it. Okay? So there's things I want to teach you that will really make this the simplest biz. Uh, you got to hustle in the beginning. These folks are hustling that you're seeing the pictures. But the recurring business that you get from it and the multitude of revenue streams and the short time frame we're doing it in and the short time space we're doing it in as far as city blocks simplifies your life. There's no doubt about it. Um, excited to leave for Texas next week for a skateboard trip. Best part, I've already approved my time off request. Meaning you're, you're your own boss. You call the shots. You know, do we have to serve our customers? Yes. But is this the type of product that we can't, uh, we, we get to make a buffer as far as uh, the, the customers go? We're, we're, they're not getting down to zero. We're not McDonald's, you know, where they order, we're done, we need pallets today. We have overlap in these orders where if I want to go out of town, I can load them up and cover a, a few weeks of time just so they don't run out while I'm gone and I'm not having to worry about it and enjoy the vacation and not have to worry about anything because I know my buyers are supplied with pallets and I've moved enough from my suppliers to make them happy. So important. Again, simplicity, so important to your life and your family and getting to spend more time with them. And like this uh, fellow's doing, he's going on a skateboard convention. You know, hopefully uh, he'll have many more. Let's go and make this a little bit bigger. This is from Mike. We recently delivered the first weekly load to a customer of 42 by 40, 42 by 42s to a client. This is hands down the best feedback we received. <laughs> Looking forward to making many more clients just as happy. So if you look down here, um, he says, no, a picture like that gets me all riled up in a good way. So again, we're dealing he sent a picture to the client of, of the delivery, right? And even though this is, I always say this is an unsexy item, when you're dealing with businesses, you know, blue collar, and, and they see nice looking product that you're able to supply them with uh, and, and take that relief and uh, load uh, worry off them and, and, and you're handling this part of their business for them where they don't have to worry about it. And they get excited about it over pallets because they know, and as you should know, without this, nothing moves. Their business comes to a standstill. It is the integral cog of the business, but nobody really thinks about it. Except this guy who's the warehouse manager is getting riled up by seeing this beautiful load of pallets that, have, that was brought to him by one of my students. Does that make sense? Unsexy, but really sexy. Let's go to the next one. Okay. this I brought this one up for a specific reason. In this group, students are always helping out students. And, and a lot of times you will get leads uh, for pallets and a need for pallets or supply of pallets outside your footprint. It's just the nature of the business. Uh, because there's businesses out there trying to solve this problem and sometimes other students come across situations that they aren't going to handle because it's five states over as an example. Well, here's an example of one of those. TSB, the simplest business people around, so, quote, I planked out the state. We have a, uh, a lead for wrong way heavy duty 4840 supplier. They're asking $3 each. So in some, these are heavy duty pallets. In some cases, we will buy pallets. And he's even saying he probably can ne negotiate them down from $3. So don't let the $3 scare you off because we're about to reveal to you what they can go for. They currently have 100 but get more every week. So he's sharing information with other students in the group. And this happens all day, every day in the training and in the group that you're supplied with. That people are sharing information between each other, helping each other out like family. Okay? So that's huge. I love it. The supplier said they are 
uh, getting $16 new from the company that he's dealing with. So you could probably sell them back for a decent profit, even at the $3 per charge. So get them for three and sell them for 16 or even less than that. That's five times your money. Okay. So I wanted you to see that and understand how we even tag stuff inside the group so people can search it later. All right. These are search terms, these little hashtags. So if anybody wanted to know about wrong way pallets or supplier, they could do searches with inside this group to find out that information. Another nugget about this um, Facebook group in addition to the training that you need to know about. Let's go to the next one. All right. My first day out yesterday, I agreed today to take 144 of these A-grade heat-treated block pallets that came from Japan. This is 57 of them on my 5 by 10 utility trader. It took me longer to figure out how to operate the straps. So he's a newbie here, struggling a little bit with the straps. And we'll, we'll make sure he gets that taken care of later. He said, it took me longer to figure out the straps than it does for most of you guys to make 200 you know, 2,000 bucks. Uh, I'll go back in the morning with a larger trader and uh, he's picking up even more. So even his first day out, he's getting traction. He's starting to uh, move these products. And I want to bring that guys to your attention and, and understand, you know, when you go out for the first day, you're going to be nervous and all that doing this. And you might, you know, trying to figure out the straps and all, but the information's there for you in the training. It's just, uh, uh, you know, real world of experiences is, is a good thing as well. So I wanted to share that folks with you with somebody just starting out. Here's a really, now the, now these posts, a lot of times are just chock full of proprietary information. And this one had a ton of it in there. So you would have access to that type of information inside the group. Unfortunately, I have to plot it out here and y'all see me do this in other videos. Apologize, but I'll give you the gist of what's going on here. This is from Dean busy week last week. I have brokered deals with three companies. Um, I think he did a typo here. In March, I have delivered 1,500 custom, 1500 custom built pallets that I have blank and just received two more orders of 1,100 more pallets. I'm actually issuing POs blank for the pallets, picking them up and delivering, uh, and delivering. I delivered a thousand Thursday and Friday. These pictures are 150 heavy duty, solid top, 4840s loaded on my 18 foot flat top trailer. Last, my last trip Friday was 188 pallets on a full, as a full load. I started doing this in late December and we'll do 25K, $25,000 in March. I tell you this to motivate you. Also an interesting lead that I have discovered is, and there's some proprietary information that I had to blank out, apologies. Um, it's kind of hard to read when you blank this stuff out. Company that had 50 for me to haul off and they're paying uh, uh, $10 per, plus they use a thousand pallets per month. Um, and I'm working to supply. So it, this is, you know, if you could see behind the red in this, there's so much information that's being shared in this group, how these deals are constructed uh, from other students as well, along with what I'm delivering in the training. So post after post after post has um, new twists on, on this business model uh, and ideas and, and information that people, uh, other students share with other students. So it becomes a invaluable resource to you if you were in this training, okay? Um, Let's go to the next one. This is totally off the wall. And I, I, here's a little secret. In this business model, you are going to come across the craziest deals that uh, have nothing even to do with pallets. Okay? Because of the nature of this business, what we come across is nuts and crazy and worth mucho dinero. Lots of money. Okay? So... Good afternoon, TSB family. Today, uh, I did a deal today for some pallets, but the manager and I, uh, but the manager said I can have all these benches for five dollars each, and there's 19 of them. How much do you think these go for, or should I just sell them to a metal scrapyard? Er, don't sell them to a scrapyard. These types of benches can go from 250 to 600 bucks a piece. 
And underneath here, there was bunches of comments um, that uh, I, I guess I cut it off when I clipped it. But there's a ton of comments underneath from uh, other students saying, I tell you where you should go to sell them, you know, for $250 to $600 a piece. And they were giving them suggestions on where to sell this item that has nothing to do with pallets to uh, a particular business, okay, or entity. All right, very cool. Love that kind of stuff. This is uh, Brene. I found a supplier of 157 pallets for 250 bucks. Same day I bought them, we, uh, we literally took them to a buyer and sold them for $900. Okay, so thank you everyone for your words of encouragement. And most of all, thank you, Mr. Wilfer. I appreciate that, Brene, uh, very much. This is a fast flip. It's a consistent flip. This is a money flip. This is a life changing flip. And consistency over and over and over again. This isn't a one off deal. Brene will be back there next week doing the same thing, picking up more and doing the same flip because they're going to have more. And the business that she's dealing with is going to run out and need more. So thanks again, uh, Brene. I appreciate you uh, shooting the shout out on there. And I think we're back to the beginning. So I hope you got some pointers out of here and understand the variety of, of revenue that comes into play with this business. All right. So I need you to go to the simplestbiz.com and opt in for more information if you haven't done that yet. Uh, check your emails once you opt it in and uh, go over some more information and then get on the phone with us and ask your questions. Uh, and then we'll go from there, okay? And we'll share with you how to get go going if you want to. You don't have to do anything on the phone, nothing like that. But we just provide information to you and then leave it up to you, okay? And we give a discount for people who book an appointment. Why? Because we know that the people who set an appointment are the kind of students that we want. We want to keep our life simple too. We don't want tire kickers. We want people who are serious about that this and see it. And, and it's a direct correlation with an appointment to someone who has success in this business. Okay. All right. Again, John Wilker with the simplest And I'm, I appreciate you spending time with me and I hope you gain some knowledge from this particular video. Have a great one.